Hello everybody, this is Theron. Welcome to Minecraft Maker. Ah, it is February, February 18th. We're getting close to the end of February and I'm still working on the uh, RPM challenge record. So this part should look familiar because this is, I showed you this before, I've added a little bit. And I started out adding one other randomizer clock out here to power all of these guys. And then I realized I didn't entirely need that and I wanted to be able to split it up a little bit. Um, so I dug trenches to bring redstone out over here, out to two new randomizer clocks and i've added a few new note blocks so actually um let me put the note blocks back and we're controlling it by the uh the blocks that go underneath so i've added a few more notes to my resource pack the dirt over here, this is like the piano or harp. I think it's a harp is what the name of the note is, but this is my big long bell like sounding thing. And then I added some over here that are uh, drum beats, my own little bass thump. So it's kind of percussive, not quite, uh, not a drum beat, but more like a, the bass. So I made my own bass note. And then here, trying to come up with something else, I, I took, the sound that this is based on, the bell sound, and I had a slightly shorter version of it, and then I started messing around with it, putting some reverb, and it, it sounded too clean and sharp on its own. And so here, uh, I've got some uh, reverb, and it, it sort of sounds a little bit more spacey now. So this should sound familiar. I have to work on the uh, the balance a little bit of the, the timing of the sounds or the frequency of, not frequency as in pitch, but uh, the frequency of which each gets played, which I can control by the number of things that I put in here. Because um, right now, sometimes it goes long stretches without playing anything, and then sometimes it goes long stretches doing nothing but playing, which is fine. That's kind of... I want that kind of randomization, but you can see what happens here is when it triggers this, sometimes it doesn't trigger it for very long, not long enough for this. You know, you'll see things pop in here. The, the sword, which is my trigger, pops in for like one tick, which is not enough to reach out here and turn on the note blocks and actually play anything. So this, this is unusually long without actually playing anything. So then I added these. Let's see if we get something here. Otherwise I'll have to go like manually override it. And, and while I like the sound, my bell sounds, and I like the, the periodic like randomness of it, and I want there to be spaces of silence in there. It was getting a little monotonous and monotonous in the, in the truest sense in that it was all basically the same note. There we go. That is beautiful. Okay. And it dropped out because I was turning around there and I won't be doing that during the actual recording. So these guys, when they go off and I can force it, Uh, let's let's go turn it on. Let's go force it. We don't need to sit around waiting for it. Whoa! Oh, he's stuck on. Oh, good. So you'll hear some of this. Come on. That's my high reverb sound, which I think is kind of cool and spacey. And then this here is. 
Come on. It's I I call the sound thump. And you're not really, well, I'm not hearing on these headphones. I hear it pretty well on my other headphones. It might be a little too low frequency. So I may need to tweak that a bit. And I can get these up. See, right now I've got these. I don't know where I have them, actually. So if I, if I put down a block of wood. Oh, you kind of heard that. I kind of heard that one. Okay, so it's a balance thing. I have to like, oops, oh shoot. Ah. Okay, I have to figure this out. So I want people to be able to hear it on typical speakers. Um, so these are probably a little low frequency. Cool. So anyway, that's, that's where we're at here. Um, and then my plan was to, after recording a bunch of this because I was getting it was a little monotonous I wanted something else I wanted something to change over time so right now what we got is we have random so you listen to it in fact every time I turn it on I get a different a different playback uh, I get a different performance and that kind of the 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 point here is that this machine itself this is the musical piece. This is the score, if you will. And <clears throat> it allows for sort of randomization, indeterminacy as John Cage would call it, but it allows for some randomization in the playback so that it is different each time. And that in order to, no one ever really hears all of it. Um, I can only record a snippet of it and present that as kind of an excerpt. And if it's interesting enough by itself that should be sufficient and I can make I can make a long recording of that which is kind of the plan I tend to make the the piece about an hour long but ideally you also have some change over time in the la my last rpm challenge piece I tried to deal with that by having the mine cart go around the the machine spitting out eggs and periodically adding chicken so over time the amount of of pressure plate sounds would increase uh, dramatically and I don't have anything like that in here and I either have to figure out how to do that or I ran I generated a bunch of additional sounds that have kind of their own periodicity to them they kind of have their own little rhythm and then I'll layer that in underneath and then do something on that mix it so that they kind of come and go over the course of the entire piece so that it is different and the beginning is noticeably different from the end. That's the goal. So we'll see. Um, but I'm getting to the point where the sound, I'm, I'm happy with the, goodness gracious. Um, I'm, I'm getting to the point where I'm happy with the soundscape as it is coming out of this. And that is really cool. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry about the sniffling. Um, it is raining here in LA. Not right at the moment, at least not at my place, but it was raining heavily yesterday. And by heavily, I mean heavily. Um, we got Los Angeles is, I think, uh, it would be safe to describe it as it's not quite a desert, although people often call it a desert. Uh, I think the technical definition of desert is less than 10 inches of rain a year. Um, and yesterday, we got four inches yesterday, all by itself. Uh, LA, typically, I think on average, when we're not in drought mode, on average, it receives about uh, 11 inches of rain a year. So it's technically just outside the the technical definition of desert 
but we don't get a lot of rain here. In fact, the Los Angeles built in essentially a big floodplain where everything comes off the the mountains that surround the city and flow down into oops, hit the microphone there, flow down into the ocean. And so that is make sure my sounds are turned up enough. So I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to balance all of this. Like uh, my music and sounds. Note block hundred. Yeah, okay, whatever. So we'll uh I'll have to play around with that for the actual recording. So to get four inches of rain in one day for Los Angeles is kind of crazy. Um, it's just it's we don't it doesn't happen very often. And this is of course an El Nino year, which is probably the uh, the main reason why it happened. Was that acting right? Yeah, it is. Okay. Okay. Oh. There's a difference. Let's go see what happens if I up the uh, delay on this on these repeaters. If we get it a little more frequently. Might be another way of controlling the relative frequencies of all the, the notes being played. Still have to wait for that sword to get into the dispenser, but into the dropper. So with all the rain we've had recently, and we've had we've had like 14 inches of rain, 14 or 15 inches of rain so far this year which is a lot it's only middle of february and our rainy season is usually kind of done by now uh so we're well above average for the year and the entire state is for the most part um so this is a little bit insane but with all the rain um all the hills and everything are completely green all the plants and everything have kind of sprouted so there's a lot of allergens in the air too And when it's uh, when it's raining, of course, all the allergens kind of get drug out of the air. But after um, after the rains have stopped and everything kind of grows and keeps putting out oh, Theron keeps putting out its uh, pollen, uh, it gets it gets a little crazy. So let's see what we got here. So anyway, my, my sinuses are going a little crazy. My allergies are trying to kill me. So that's why I'm sniffling. Sorry about that. Oh, I didn't retune these. That's kind of cool, actually. I might want to leave that like that. So no blocks if you aren't aware. They take a single sound and they change the pitch um, for the, each of the notes in the note block. So when you when you place a note block and you right click on it, let's turn up my game sounds a bit, huh? Um, <clears throat> it's it's basically taking a single sound file, just playing back slower or faster. Mm -hmm. 
And when you first place it, it's down an octave from, from the note itself. So if you right click on it 12 times, that's what the actual sound sounds like. For some reason that bass sound, they chose F sharp, which is a little interesting. Oh, that actually does sound super cool. Okay. So anyway, that's the update. We are well underway. I could record it. I could record a chunk of this and maybe go in and uh, add some some of the other sounds that I generated separately and uh, and have my piece. So I can finish the album pretty much at any time, but it's still not quite where I want it. So I'm gonna spend some more time playing with it and uh, we will see. Uh, so anyway, I hope you found this interesting. Uh, I will post this. Uh, all my other videos are about three, four weeks behind schedule. I'm, I'm recorded ahead a bit. Uh, this one I'm gonna try and publish on Tuesday uh, along with a <clears throat> uh, a Minecraft land party episode but we'll see if that actually happens um, I've got some uh, time commitments this the rest of this month which are going to make things a little bit crazy so we may have a little bit of difficulty uh, doing that but we will we'll do what we can and let's, actually this is kind of a let's get a screenshot here it up nice so that's what's going on and of course when I get it all done I'll post the uh, the link to it and, and if I have another update I will I will share that so there we go thank you for watching this is Theron this is Minecraft land party and I will see you next time right bye